will do things them very 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 fast so we will start today with the news way it come for ground zero say simon monzo i think when i know simon monzo very well now the architect now one of the pioneer them where we lay the foundation for the all anglophone conference where we produce the the southern the scnc southern cameroon national council we will be mandated say without within a reasonable period of time if mr pobia and la republic du cameroon they no can shut down, down for negotiate and for adjust the constitution make will be united as one country ambazonian it will be liberated we will get the right to declare our independence simon monzo ian uh, carson and yangwewe pobia be appoints them they don't take two different parts why would I see Carson and Yangwe stand with the population? He abandoned his life for, Camar for Cameroon and for Ambazonia, for live as a refugee and an exile person for South Africa, keep on fighting, giving up his position with the Fofi, giving ministers and all those things, but for stand for integrity, for stand for truth, and for defend the cause of the legitimacy and sovereignty of Southern Cameroon territory. Another person where he be the worker at the same foot, Simon Muzu, for the other hand, he then choose the easy part for continue for lobby La Republic du Cameroon for your own comfort and for your own stomach. Today, with the ESA, he then launch a new coalition for federalism. The one guy that said the one for begin to represent federation. We think say this looks like a reaction. How the Nancy say finally all the various stakeholders them where they represent various interest groups, various opinion them for the future of our country. They don't gather for the CDN retreat and they don't come for resolve for one thing. So the will of the people, which is determined already to be that for independence, make it be not the one way all groups them meet and stand for support them, irrespective whether you are federalist, you are unionist, or whatever comes the minority may find themselves in, then get an obligation for support what the people want, which is outright separation and independence. So we think, say, La Republic also, that they adjust themselves this one will be genuine federalism. Them. This one are paid agents where they work with La Republic to Cameroon. From our observation and our intelligent gathering, we don't see say most of those groups them where they be done get contract with the Prime Minister office for try to engage with act activists them for inside Ambazonia for lure them with bribery and corruption. Mean they, mean they abandon the Ambazonian people their aspiration in favor of their own career. Most of those same contacts them. Now the way they don't be recruited for this movement with uh, Monzo. For those Ambazonia, the way they feel they worried, say this type of a movement, they feel also try to get into the list of organization, the way they sit for the platform for the CDN. I want for talk say, just like uh, Agbobala, which we, we, don't, we, we, we get a lot of issue with Agbobala presence for day. Now the same thing we go be with Simon Monzo and even more. We go resist them, but at the end of the day, we need to understand, say, even the worst come to the worst. Even on that negotiation table, we will likely get people them the way. Now, connect people them, people the way they like spy, people the way they go to represent the regime for La Republic to Cameroon. So long as we don't make sure, say, in any format, if it comes to that, because we are not fighting for, for, for negotiation, we are not, our priority is to liberate, is not to negotiate. So, but we have to, our people they need to understand, See, the works of spies and black legs and all those type of people will not stop. Even when we are independent country, you will still have spies amongst us. America is spying on their own ally, the British and the Germans. So we should expect that even when we are going to negotiation table, there will be people, the way people, they don't go like them around that area. But we go only go for a negotiation table. We will be led by the the nationalists we will be championed by those who are actually fighting for the people on the ground that is what we can agree for and that is only the type of formation we can get into i think the president of the governing council then released a statement talking about other things but it then basically laid the principle and the thinking of the day within the, within the ambazonia governing council so in any case they will give give a, an example for the president for Colombia, we ask the cabinet member, Migo, she don't call that person, we want to kill And uh, we don't know this, the main, main part of the story. The way I say, we will not be surprised. There is other, since the, the CDN come retreat, plenty other organization, they then they come up for show interest for our, our war, 
plenty of organizations that they try to bring up conferences. Would I see her joint statement? Make her bring this uh, joint statement from the diplomatic call for Yaoundé. Then to the land show interest, never before interest. When I imagine, say, the time where Fontem Nibabi, they try to bring up this SCLC e, 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 or whatever name it is called for America, they be the promise we say all diplomatic call, they be BD, they no be B for day. Now we all the diplomatic call, they run before inside CD and their own, and they, they talk now language, they no be talking before. The same people that they try to discredit the, the new found uh, coming together for a purpose for the Amazonian people. So make our people they understand say now more and more international partners they come. There is a pipe in the pipeline. There, there is a talk of another organization for peace where that invite all the various movement them as well. Maybe the CDN this time. There another movement around uh, Asia also where they want to invite Ambazonian leaders the Middle and Shidong as the war they try to bring our people then together to see how the free force like the public for negotiate. In any case, we are focused on our liberation and we should buy more guns. That is a solution against Cameroon terrorism. So from there, I want to take on, ladies and gentlemen, how La Republic du Cameroon, the Rambikin Institute, a roadblock for inside our country. For inside Benguide, images that show how we, since the Ambazonia Defense Forces would not carry out multiple attacks, one with the explosion, we take place for for inside uh, tanker, as soon as we see the video, the pictures that we take place inside tanker, we don't get multiple victory using explosive devices and ambush. The greatest fear for La Republic du Cameroon now our ability to carry out raid. They did just imagine when we will be transformed, not for just hit and run with IED, but hit and carry out raid. And we actually say it don't cripple them today as they run block Bengui Road, they never Bengui Road, now they raid. Now, now read this way, Ambazonia Defense Forces then carry them against their troops. Them, it don't make and they don't become fear, so they don't go block uh, Bengui Road. They they need the permit driver they made them pass for Bengui Road. They don't also block Manfe Road, La Republic du Cameroon. They don't block the whole Trans-Saharan African Highway now for close to seven days because they are afraid. They don't be stopped. They be a stalemate. They cannot move on the terrain because they are afraid of our ID, IED attacks. And the possibility of us carrying out raid, and uh, we be very happy. We we'll see how they be frustrated by the day. We we'll see how we we'll then cripple and bring to the news one of the biggest army for inside Africa, and this one it then prove right all those where they be done right them for one like the Republic of Cameroon. Say so you cannot beat a people who are determined like the Ambazonians inside their own land. We shall bleed them out of our territories. So. Also, would I also see, say, even within urban areas, La Republic du Cameroon, they not be more, they not still be capable again for drive with their own vehicles then. Because our civilians and our military people them, they, they work hand in hand, our intelligence officer them, they, they pick up La Republic, they, they send with messages, uh, video for, footages, pictures of their movement, life, and they, they help with for protect our population and also for keep ourselves safe and for attack them more effectively. This one, it don't make it don't reduce the ability for navigate our territory and for patrol our territory now. Then be forced for the use of private cars, even within urban areas. Then now they use mostly the private cars. Now for sure, when I said I frustrated and a defeated army, we will face them now. They don't turn also for being use scare tactics for being frightened people. Then I mean they need to provide intelligence by using mobile phones. But our people then they be resilient, they will continue for do just that until the like public is kicked out of our national territories this all this action that they go on when i know as a dying horse you know go always stop but you go struggle for give it kicks them would not get very disturbing images the way they come for my aid for instance mancon how well like republic to cameroon they don't come burn some house for some family this late this one will be led by a black leg from which would understand make her bring the video footage is them now two video footages then they it look like another load one. So why are you want to load this video? I go first bring the one we would not see I'm for inside uh, Bali Nyonga. Before I go transfer the rest. Now just give me a moment. It'd be important to put out this video. A private residence for my aid for Mancon, it be burned down to the ground by the Cameroon terrorist forces. I will transfer the video into my mobile device. Okay. The 
this is important oops where is it okay there we go it's not going okay oh yeah it is there now okay so ladies and gentlemen we will start with this video footage is them now evidence and this will come from ground zero as we don't talk me about people that always begin use their mobile phone this one now for insta bali nyonga we don't see video footage is the way they show like the public to come around their terrorist forces them they, they carry out crimes against humanity they carry out pure terrorism our population each time when they see attack like this one me then try to call our forces them for intervene the terrorist cowards them they go abandon those villages they run each time we will intervene we will continue to mobilize and try to increase our mobility for intervene in such acts of terrorism and criminalities of the Cameroon military when we see their military vehicle for day so make we see them when i see the same thing with the a so-called professional military they do work at do them do one have a show and i say the Cameroon military they carry out a systemic attack against innocent civilians, against villages. This must be coming from the top because it don't go on and on and on. The evidence that be presented for them by human rights organizations and we would put them every out every day for our day for show now exactly the conduct of La Republic to Cameroon for inside Ambazonian territory. And the other footage is what I would bring up for now. Now when we come up for inside Mancon, for my aid for Mancon, we like the public to Cameroon, the campus on Omani House, as soon as we see the video, come burn them. For the information of the get them, then come for inside my aid for the inside moto, with one black leg where they record the boy saying the Emma, the Emma and mechanic where they walk around, uh, I think you know me, Timto, Timto Motel. Around team to motel day for my aid. Director for my aid. They don't come the money. Burn the house down to ashes. Burn the house. Follow a man who shoot and shoot. They no get and thank God to the man success. They run. They no get it. So now see, now person in houses, big family house. You don't should do it for your house. Around six o'clock for morning time. Burn all thing, even foul day. Life foul them for the keeper, the garden and bona. They follow a mass of gun shoot so they eat dodge bullets so they succeed run. Now B. Now ye. Now Cameroon B. They call another battalion, intervention, rapid or whatever they call the name. So, when I see nice family, so for inside Bamenda for my aid, La Republic du Cameroon, the military just come for day for morning, morning time, around six o'clock for morning time, according to the information of the year, they will be led by a black leg. We come inside their armored car. They can't stand for inside the man. He has a businessman for Bamenda. Innocent man. Innocent man where he sleep a house. They can't stand for shoot gun. Luckily for the man, he here for house had a detox. They did find some man where he make a bomb them for ADF. How come man when a businessman, he did with the family for house, he could make bomb. He did make bomb for both side. So now wait till that way it happen. Hello. Yes, I'm live online. I don't know if you oh, want to participate. My man, my real man, man. <laughs> if you don't know me, you never talked to me before. But me, I'm going to talk for you now, so I'm glad to hear your voice. Yes, sir. I am online live and everybody can hear you. Maybe you want to call back later? Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, no, I like to call you back. Let me hear you talk, okay? Okay, okay. God bless you. Well, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really, really, really proud of the work you do, my brother. Okay. Good job. Good job. Okay. Thanks. So, ladies and gentlemen, now they think this way our population, they face them every day. Nobody is safe 
no matter what you are doing. Maybe you're just living your normal life, doing your business. You don't know when La Republic, it just wait me so man make a false report. They no go investigate them. They could do enter for your house. They could burn your house. They could kill you. They could rape your woman. They could destroy your crops and punish you for no nothing. If you be boy, you don't look strong. Le man if you carry gun, you already be guilty for their eye. They did you wait me you shake. They could kill you. Whether you be woman, you carry a picking, you go for school. You know, be safe. Even if they stop money, they ask driver money, you know, gam. They feel move gun, you shoot them. Even if you pass na pass a corner, corner road, le baby brandy for inside Bamenda, you know, matter na matter. Say picking the corner, they go move gun, they go shoot them. Nobody, you know, be safe for this Cameroon terrorism. The Cameroon terrorists shit no white blast forces the way that they roam around our land, struggling to impose an alien rule over our territory. Our people they need to be mindful. And for be careful for no see this one a dangerous time and the need for come together as one person for fight this Cameroon terrorism and Cameroon occupation over our territory. So before we want go for the next thing before I, I want for, for talk about which we happen for would they get news where they come from uh from uh, the C C N A one very renowned Newspaper and online newspaper magazine where he done talk say uh, King Commando of the TTA, the founder and head of the TTA, say he done fall for battle. Would I also hear for some Ambazonian activists the way they done publish them? Say King Commando, he done fall. Me too, I done, I done publish them based on those publications. But the war council, he never yet get confirmation say that events that happen. La Republic also, they never publish them like how they always try for, for be very proud each time we didn't kill any of our fighters. So for now, we they still go with the news outside, but officially, the War Council have not confirmed that King Commando have fallen, but we are we think that he has probably fallen because we knew that he was in a mission in a, in a, in the area there. It, it's a very sad day for us if this is confirmed that King Commando have fallen down and uh, it just today I be discuss I be get a meeting with uh, after my work I be get a meeting with our supreme commander on the ground, General Ifang, after the, the a memo from the the president of the governing council, and we will discuss extensively for an ongoing discussion way it be done to go on for the background between uh, commando and our forces on the ground and uh, Siko Johnson and even uh, John Bakuro was involved. So we will not try to resolve the issue then for ground zero and we will be now for implementation phase. We we'll try to bring the, the, the people then together for, to create something where people then feel identify with them irrespective of their affiliation and their groups. And we'll just discuss those talk finish with the uh, with, uh, Supreme Commander General Efang. And just after they drop the phone call, for, we, we, we had to get this message about commando. It just be very sad. At a time where Idam decide to abandon the, the, the people the way they instigate inside fighting, Idam come to his senses. He did try now for reconcile with his brothers um, and for make sure Simi Oman they walk towards one direction. Now just the time would he hear this type of thing. And it make we would see the, the intelligence we see could be share them. If we come, if we ram, maybe now they fear for this type of events, be make them, he can explain for we how we uh, Irene Gua, his brother. I put a picture again, Henry ba, uh, Baboku, whoever he is, is a Cameroon adjudant chef. When I ring my brother, she could be the talker, he be the treating the life of a commando. How if he lead people the right for placing commando, he be he the hide for day. He means say there be no time where they, they be free key commando any moment. Now he be just be at their mercy. So if he be a likely, uh, the likely person that way they come for our mind. Maybe not because just like Dada, Tawi Dada be leave abandon them. He come for we then go expose it place where he hide there for inside the bank with the fight for the so we, we, we have not confirmed anything but that will be what have come to my mind and I want to remind our people then say nobody stay long way see could down warn about the threat for commando in life and uh, this news where nobody yet be confirmed would go ahead with the news for belief say it actually fall for inside and gi. They will never get any positive confirmation. So the war cancer is still waiting on the ground. We were in the middle of discussion with him on how to, to collaborate. The TTA now almost done be 
in two factions they guide them in gozang they don't be almost separated from the other ones in my my 90 and things like that but we we just pray for his family and his loved ones as a country it is be it's a big blow for any soldier to fall it, it, it's a big blow but we'll continue to hold the mantle we know say these boys them they don't put their life because the one will get freedom now a duty for we for make sure they will complete that journey say their life where they don't sacrifice them their money their time the pleasure where they don't give an offer fight for our freedom in no go in vain so ladies and gentlemen we will come back for that one later but i bring good news to now today say our forces them for ground zero finally they don't gather together for our second meeting this one will be a conference now for for practical things we don't get all of our top commander for all our bases and for inside the great state of we including our civil our civil representative the other picture look like i not put the other annual transfer the other picture as well that's really unfortunate I, anyway it's just because we are so busy i hope you guys will understand but uh basically we also had our general Ibube also was there this time he came around and all the other leaders all the commanders from all of our camps in uh, in we were there make her bring the other pictures with Ibube. okay that may take time so i will just leave it but this is breaking news where they come from ground zero will be this meeting will be scheduled for today and after the meeting it will be scheduled the information will be out there the Bui warriors and where they control uh isobu the so-called worldwide or whatever the the group where sako get up for they leak out the information detailed information the location and the name of the people where they will attend them they will put them for social media probably for tip up tip off uh, la republic their military but nevertheless will be adjust as a as a, as a resort and the meeting it doesn't take place the meeting they all they don't decide to resolve for reject the whole ideology where they come from the splinter ig group say me then declare war against the adf say me then me one come they go disarm another one or for go fight another one all they don't decide they don't she don't discuss very well deliberate very well and they don't resolve say they don't reject the idea for attack any other camp they don't recognize all the camps the way they be there for the the marine force of bambalang of no pity the boy warriors as well as the adf they don't promise and they don't swear for fight hand in hand against cameroon military they don't also resolve say an attack for each camp between these three comes them the the bambalang forces of the marine force of bambalang under general no pity the boy warriors as well with the various commander they in day for day and the Ambazonia Defense Forces with our own commander we did for the all of them for inside that room. They don't decide. If you attack one of them, you don't attack all of them. All of them go coordinate their response. And all of the run promises they go focus for fight against Cameroon occupation, against the Cameroon government army with the inside Ambazonia, all over our territory and in Bui. So that is a great thing. That is a great cons that's a great uh, consensus with the run come, uh, come come together. We need to applaud them. And uh, we need to continue to encourage collaboration as we don't encourage them from the governing council and the ADF. And on this platform, we don't always push them as the leader of our war of liberation. You don't talk in the best and the most effective way that for we will go forward. Ladies and gentlemen, I will just jump straight into a video where um, Clovis Nachop, he don't come out from his basement and he don't put out a, 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 a video. But before I go there, I think there are some images I want to bring up for now. We 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 done for a long time. We done hear about uh, this this guy, Michel Bientong. I think you guys know him now. One francophone. He's a French Cameroon citizen, and this guy have practically. People have said that the the Sako have paid him, but I have no evidence for that. I must I must say. I have no evidence for that, but what I know is that. When the guy was leaving uh, Cameroon, he contacted. Oh, sorry, I cannot get this thing. <laughs> so this guy, Michel, this guy Michel Bientong, now a, a journalist. The time where he be the one run away from, uh, run away because we don't know now whether he be the run away now for run away or he be the play now play. But he be contact the Ambazonia Defense Forces. Then that way the one run away. Say he get problem with Pobia, 
who help you with some more money you run and it's a person where he be likely be interested in money or a person where the like Republic government say he, we don't know but indeed we we'll see hand work and he hand work in detail a lot of things about he since he come and be a stone supporter of Sako unlike other Francophones and French Cameroon citizens where they spend their time to criticize the Cameroon government when a tyrannic and a puppet government for inside their country, he did spend the time for make up stories, lies about Dr. Cho Ayaba, about ADF, and is disturbing and is confusing to a lay people. But recently, he did exposed himself as a scammer, as a liar, and a petite thief. We don't see how he did lie, say Dr. Cho Ayaba, he go for Yaoundé. He did lie all type of lies about me, about a ADF, about our forces, and all those type of stuff. The last time, he, the only proof we be bring, we bring a fake a audio from <laughs> Kunyam Titus, and this time again, he don't go for Twitter, and uh, this this is very important. That's why I bring the topic up again today. So, sorry because of the the images are not are not put in order in my in my computer. It will take me some time for put them in order, but he don't come out. He don't go post. Uh, this is what happened. So this guy Michel Bientong. He don't go for, would I inform the Ambazonian people? Say La Republic du Cameroon. He did partner with Facebook page for try for suppress Ambazonia their aspiration and our voices. And they target we for the ADF and me in particular very strongly. They don't ban the ADF for Facebook. We don't know very well. Oh, this is public knowledge. Facebook page in it allow me, Capo Daniel, for create Facebook with my face. That's why for all the other Facebook alternative Facebook pages, the word and create them at the way in a cap for day before they allow them. They need allow me for use my name Capo Daniel for create Facebook. I don't try. It reject them when I put my face. Maybe if I tweak them, I don't know. But I don't be forced for use other names them other than the name where they go about with them. But inside this our struggle. But yet at the same time, Facebook page it don't allow La Republic du Cameroon. Their, their military for create a fake Facebook page where they call them Capo Daniel DDC. They, they impersonate me, they don't put my picture for day, and they use them for spread disinformation. We don't come in good faith, inform the general public numerous times, say me then disregard any information we come up for day. That one have a show and I say, you know, be involved with we in any shape or form. Otherwise, we no go to come to tell and I say, me wanna disregard any two and post them for day. We don't encourage people then within our organization and the general public. For make report for that Facebook page, say they share fake news and they share defamation and hate speech, so that me Facebook taken down. Numerous people they don't go for day. They wonder who oh, we know them, they don't go for day also. Facebook page, you know, take down that page. But yet, Facebook page, it take down other pages, all oh, they set them up with no violation of their community rules. Now, for tell one of the mafia where they go. So, a similar Facebook page, it can be created using the name of Tapang Ivor. And his picture. This one is then only for inflame things them out of context. When I know say after La Republic, after the Nigerian government, if he announced say ADF he that attack, say Ambazonian forces that attack a village for manga for inside Nigeria. The Ambazonian governing council, the president, Dr. Chua Yaba, he come out can talk say we were not involved. It was not an Ambazonian attack. So now our position that officially, but yet Cameroon government for try for so confusion. Then go post them for that their fake Facebook page. Say Tapang Ivo, he don't talk say na Ambazonian, they don't go carry out that attack. Michel Bientong, he carry and go post them now for a Twitter for tell the world say that attack for Nigeria. Na Ambazonian Defense Forces, them they carry out that attack. Na complete lies, na complete defamation, na distortion for tarnish the reputation of our liberation movement. Immediately he post them up. This time, not be only Ambazonian, they notice them. But you get an independent observer where they call him Mr. Roberts. Now, first, we don't do a lot of research about our our, our struggle. He, he noticed some and he make a post, a comment, for point them out for Michel Bientong. Say they so that particular information we post them na fake news. Now, he post this way, put them. He talk for they say, na fake news, Michel Bientong, he that me, me drop down that story. Michel Bientong, he respond by blocking he. The one that for proof, say the Michel Bientong, even when there is evidence for the contrary, or people that they indicate for you, say the information it be fake, it is to go ahead for post the fake information. 
na for sure na say no get no credibility make no man no ever take anything with the talk am seriously na somebody will just be bent for blackmail he dey go out there they post things and we in no say be na lie the fact say an independent person mr chris roberts he don't contact you for telly say na na fake news where he post them he still go ahead for bloggy post them he dey show na say na lie in the exchange between he and mr chris robert chris robert also make this post for facebook page where he really be telling and i think he be worth showing for now in this fake in this other twitter chris robert talk say the news posted by michelle bientong na lie he say you are copying information that does not come from the adf but fake adf source which is either which either makes you part of the false information campaign usually promoted by the regime or you just aren't doing your work your homework so me it talk for this say simply say that michelle bientong it go take things of a fake facebook page and they put and say na adf the talker we no be adf talker say me say that michelle bientong na surely he be one of the people that way and they behind that fake information or na just person way be stupid you know no have to do work for journalists because the a journalist you need you get responsibility for do basic research and about the information you put them out there for public for make sure say be na true so ladies and gentlemen michelle bentong na lapsap na shit no white blast na shumbo una ignore he una not take any to talk and seriously is somebody who have no credibility he's not a dignified person he's not worth your attention he's not worthy leave him to himself we will not bother about him but i have to bring it up because at least he has dragged the attention of a, of a researcher that have shown a lot of interest to our our plight now ladies and gentlemen i want to bring a video an outing this is not somebody that i usually would, would pay attention to but my attention have been drawn to clovis nachop one of the staunch supporter for 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 sako ikome the ig splinter group way down the campaign clovis nachop he been noted for come out and begin to say fake stories and lies about the adf saying adf is working with like republic and all those type of lies saying that of the true however is working for like republic i've traveled to you on there all those type of lies so today we will play a video where them come out with them the recent one in a trend of long line of people the way they, they work with sako where they, they come out for dumpy and for talk about the truth way they go on for day this is an excerpt of a video where i go and play them for namego nasia i go to analyze the video as you go to play Which don't ever you say? This kind of thing. Which don't ever say ADF? No, talk the truth. Which don't ever you say ADF? ADF fighter. They get clash among themselves. No, be honest. Which they? Even though they're not plenty. Which don't ever you say? Even though they cannot. Which don't ever you? So, Mr. Clovis, he did talk say which day did I say ADF the fight amongst themselves? Of course, it is be, it be very unlikely say ADF go fight amongst themselves. Why? Because ADF no be just a force who do go pick and for road or go bribe some people and give them money. Say me then join we. ADF na a professional military where he found as them. They don't get experience for fight against the Republic. They don't go through all type of training them. Then they go for ground zero, recruit boy them, call pick up pictures them, give them military training. ADF na an na a professional military for Amazonia, we then get ranks and files, we get command structure, we get the leader for ground and we get the leader for diaspora. Na a national army, na a national army. In terms of size, ADF is the biggest force in Amazonia. Even if you want to compare it based on the video footages you have seen on social media, go and look our parades in 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 Lebialem, our parades in Manu. Our parades in uh, in Batibo and all those places in Anya and all those places, there is no competition. We are all over the place. We are the biggest force in Ambazonia. Unlike the other forces, you have different different forces. All of them on their own right. It's not even a competition, but just because he mentioned them, 
it should not surprise you that ADF do not fight, fight against himself because ADF have arrived at a criteria called a force. We have a command structure, we are organized, and we are focused on our mission to liberate Ambazonia. That is why you don't find, find us fighting against each other. There is not fighting for position because our focus is not about position. Our focus is about fighting for liberation of Ambazonia. I will talk about the problem of leadership inside Ambazonia. You see, Ambazonia, no. Now, when I blame Ayaba, I blame Ayuk, I blame all the people. Because now, Ambazonia is a move. When I don't forget one thing, when I don't see me, I don't, I don't attack Ayaba Chu a plenty time, but I want to want him. Ayaba Chu and Ambazonia. And where the guy they feel them because say, they feel say they must use they must enforce themselves on Ambazonians. My attention to who be ever not say Dr. Sako will take power from my Yukabe. So amongst all the, the thing where he talk, he, he, in your own mind, Dr. Chu Ayaba the force itself upon Ambazonians. Eh? Mr. Clovis, I think you need to do a little bit of research on what you talk about them, about the organization and the personality you talk about them. Dr. Chu Ayaba have always worked from the All Anglophone Conference, working even as a bodyguard to Frundi. He's always a savior, saving other leaders, saving the people, work tirelessly. Ebenezer Akwanga then give examples of how selfless he be. He abandoned even the corpse of his family for can't save Ambazonia their interests. Together with all the patriots, the way he then attacked them for that organization, or way they be there for that organization, like Sheikh Kavi, uh, Benadikwa, these are people who have fought on the ground. Sheikh Kavi, these people abandon life in the diaspora, go in the forest and train Ambazonian forces for six months. At one time, the family of Sheikh Kavi was almost removed out of the out of the house because he, he did not pay rent. He was in the forest working for us. These are patriots. Dr. Cho Ayaba was elected as a leader of the Ambazonian Governing Council through a democratic means. He did not force himself. He was nominated by other people. He did not push himself. He did not apply to be nominated. He was nominated because of his personality, his leadership skills, and he's the leader of the biggest movement we have, the Ambazonia Governing Council. He's not forcing himself on any Ambazonians. A group of Ambazonian people, now they have over 38 different missions across the globe under the Ambazonia Governing Council. And we have forces on the ground, transitional authorities on the ground, who are representing our organization. This is the biggest movement in Ambazonia, the biggest organization. We don't force ourselves. We are Ambazonians. We are exercising our rights to represent and organize ourselves to represent the interests of our country. This is our right. It's our God-given right. To see it as people imposing themselves doesn't make sense to me. It's just, uh, I think, intellectually not sound. Anyway, we will go. In this struggle, you understand, you get different stages. You get that way, you need a calm person, maybe a strategist. But you get that way, you need an outspoken person, like Sergio Chris, or like, um, like Ayaba. One good thing about Ayaba, despite the odds of Ayaba, Ayaba Chu, that person way, if he hear the talk sometime, he gets away the talk. He the talk some kind of way, so where he good. We sometimes you need that kind of way for talk against your enemy. You know, always one can the one can talk. What? Man, follow me, please. My man, listen, this is war. What? <laughs> it just surprised me because Clovis and spent all his time for lie about Ayabacho. Because Dr. Chu Ayaba either extend a hand, either talk say make we as the officials who will take our care from him, say we will reach out for people like this and try to encourage them to be reasonable. And Idan talks say this is a fight about truth against deceit, against lie. Perhaps Clovis and the rest of those people, J. Carl, in their mind, they thought that we were fighting them. <laughs> Maybe in their mind. They were coming out and lying, thinking that we were lying. Because I remember the time we first do the first parade two years ago in our mother base. They, 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 some of them, they said that our guns were toy guns. Maybe they were in their own eyes, they could not imagine that we could work so hard 
and provide those weapons for our soldiers. Maybe perhaps they are maybe they don't really they are not they don't really believe all these things. Perhaps they were being fed with fake information. Or oh, Chris, oh, uh, Chris, uh, Christopher Anu and Sako might have just been giving them those type of information, or they just wanted to be lawyer and they think that what we do we're just supporting our side. No, we were not. We are very factual people. We follow the evidence. We 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 are patriot. We love our country. We have principles that we believe are the most effective way to lead a country and a collective struggle like ours. These are principles that have been tested by many other people. Every time you do something collectively, democratic principles must apply. You must respect the rules. Today, the same complaint you are giving about Sako, is it not the same thing you cover up when it was Seseko's turn? Why did you not stand up for Seseko the way you want you are standing up for Sako? It means you are just you are just saying things because of the leader. It wasn't saying things because of the truth. Look at what is happening in Bui. Where is the Sako and the Nachop that you were saying that those are your forces when they were carrying out actions? You are nowhere to be found. Me for this platform, I take my time for two days. I told you people that we want to bring all the forces together. We have called upon Kapo, giving him the mandate, and we are encouraging No Pity and the Warriors to come together and resolve their things peacefully. I call for Yerima. I call for Honor Weber. I call even for you people. And I said, every activist, the 24 different organizations that are struggling to go to negotiate, they should come and prove that they are there to help Ambazonia by helping to solve this problem. How many people got involved? Today, when you see them sit together, some of you, you are there shouting, oh, it's not ADF, it is ADF. We don't care about credit. But we give credit to the soldiers because they, them too, they themselves wanted to resolve it peacefully. Otherwise, whatever we try to encourage or to facilitate will not have worked. But definitely, we are patriot. We are patriot. All the lies that Clovis Nachop had said in the past, I don't know his motivation, but it was very selfish. Because if you are lying deliberately, knowing that you are lying, I don't know what can justify that. I don't know. Today you are calling Sako out and Iringwa for stealing money. That is what I have been saying for three years. And you have been insulting me. Protecting Sako. Today, because Sako and the Iringwa don't want to... I don't know what is really going on with you, with you guys there. But you are now coming out to expose him. Why? Because he doesn't want Chris Anu. Or because he doesn't want you people again. And he's, he's, he's choosing the person that we told you people from the beginning that... Iringwa was sent there. There is audio from Bandam saying that he had picked Iringwa and sent Iringwa to Sako. There are people within his administration where they call them what are LGA what? That are agents that have been assigned to him and he cannot do without them. No matter what you do, whether it is right or wrong, Sako cannot. He is engaged. You people ignore everything. You have a duty to question your leader. In the Ambazonia Governing Council, when we have even silly allegations against our leader, we pose it to him. Privately, within our setting, we pose it to him. He has an office space that we participated. Each official has their office space. We confront them. It is our duty. Why are you saying these things just now? Anyway, they say it's better late than never. But I will say... You have to at least apologize for the past things that you have said and at least put it in a perspective so that we can actually look at you in the eyes. You're coming from your basement and saying all these things. You have grown beers like, <laughs> I don't know what is happening with you. But we are men of integrity. We are patriot. We serve our country with national pride. I will say this one. In the beginning of this struggle, I also was following the struggle and when Sisiko emerged, I did not really care about how he emerged. I'd be just this for, for maybe if we just support him, everything will be fine. And Ayabacho and Akwanga and all the nationalist movement, all the nationalist movement who were complaining. I did not take time to study it until I saw that things were not going, even though we, we supported Sisiko, things were not going. 
So I, I turned back to this guy and do, I did my research. And I realized that they were they were right. And I took it to Seseko. Like a leader that I support. And I tell him, this is, this, this is. But why are you not doing this? Why? These people are right. And eventually, it's a, it's a, it is what it is. It is what it is. In the Ambazonia Governing Council, we all hold each other to account. You cannot just come and lie to Ambazonia people and they will allow you. You will not. Everything I say here, I go back to the organization. People will question me. Why did you say this? What is the proof? Show us the proof. Otherwise, we will not back you. you it's, it's very worrying that you people are in that group. You created a group called the Blue and White Army, specifically to blackmail other Ambazonian leaders and other factions. Specifically to blackmail them. You are partnering with Cameroon agents like Michel Bientong. That is evidence to everybody today that he's an agent. You're coming to lie about forces on the ground. Saying they should go and kill forces on the ground. For goodness sake. People's children. Clovis. That's what you were saying. Joining the Francophones and the Sako and Chris. And to ask them to keep soldiers to kill all ADF soldiers on the ground. And you know that these people are fighting for Ambazonia. Yet you ask people to kill them. You wish them dead. I cannot wrap my head around. I cannot, I cannot wrap my heart, my head around it. And I hope the good Lord touches your heart, that you 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 look for justice, because there are so many people you have hurt. You have killed people without knowing. Do you think the soldiers that died because they they were ADF, in the hands of other soldiers who could not, who were manipulated by those social media posts you put, you are not responsible. You are responsible ultimately for what you say. I take responsibility for everything I say on social media. Everything I say, I take responsibility. I will not say things I cannot take responsibility of. Not even if I about you ask me to say so. Not even if I about you ask me to say so. You cannot come on social media and ask people to go and kill ADF fighters. Today you are appreciating I about you. May God touch your heart and let you apologize. Clean yourself and just be fair. Nobody is asking you to, 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 I don't, we are not asking you to do this. But we welcome it. We welcome when people have a turn around and they realize themselves. We welcome it. But if I have something to say to you, Clovis, Nachop, and to all those who are with you, struggling to find a way out and they are realizing themselves like many soldiers have realized themselves on ground zero you guys have apologies to give and you have to restore the broken hearts in ground zero all the lies you have been telling people that the ig is a government i created the ig i was there i created it it is not a government dr carson and yangwe the author have said it milton takam have said it we should stop lies and we should be honest. I see even Yerima, the, after coming from the retreat, when he sees that Sako is going down, he is not no, no longer using IG care. They are now calling it back IG. They should remember they promised the Ambazonian people in, in the scarf, Mark Barata's thing, in scarf that they are transitioning into something else. They have realized the error they make to create that, 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 uh, that, that appearance of a government or that claim of a government was a mistake. And if they are going back to that mistake, after they have seen all the effect, then one has to question their love for country and their patriotism. So ladies and gentlemen, that is it for today. And uh, we hope to you continue to hear from us. The podcast will be coming and we have big things coming to you. La Republic du Cameroon, as you see in Ground Zero, are in a standstill. They have reached a stalemate. They don't know how to move. They are afraid of Ambazonian forces. We have bigger things waiting for them. We go jam jam them. One by one. We go bleed them out of our country. We will win. Fatly. We will. Join the resistance. Do the right thing. Do your patriotic duty. Support the resistance on the ground. God bless you. Good night. Ciao.